Hey, man, motherfuckers be like, game too old to do this, and ain't he 41, and he can't do this, and he shouldn't say that, and he, oh, my God, like, yo, you so childish, and you this, and you that, and motherfuckers, don't nobody give a fuck about what y'all saying? Nobody don't give a fuck about you saying a nigga too old for this and too young for that and somebody too big to do this or they shouldn't have their kids doing that or motherfucking like, like the shit y'all doing with, you know, doing the Lizzo, you know what I'm saying? Like got her crying on the internet and doing all that. Motherfuckers like, y'all fans, man. Y'all fans. Stay fans. Stay in y'all place, man. And you know what I'm saying? If somebody was motherfucking on your ass every day judging your motherfucking life, what would that look like? What would your house look like? What your age look like? Is you too old? You too young? You, what, what the fuck is wrong with you? Huh? Y'all got too much motherfucking time to be worried about other motherfuckers' lives. And I understand that niggas are celebrities and all that. Me? I welcome that shit. You can come on my page and say whatever the fuck you want. You can call me a fake blood. I'm too old. I'm too young. I don't give a fuck about what the fuck you saying, partner. I'm living my motherfucking life, nigga. Nigga, I'm young, black, and beautiful out here. I ain't never had a problem. Nigga, always been getting it my way, having it my way. Nigga, I'm alive. Nigga, and I'm well. My kids is beautiful, doing well. One going off to college. One too damn tall for her own good. She modeling. My other son play video games and get his schoolwork done. Fuck y'all. Who the fuck is you? Like, who the fuck is y'all, man? Who died and made y'all niggas important, man? All right? I don't give a fuck about none of that. So bring it to my page. Keep the hate going. Niggas ain't nothing but fans. Lizzo, you know I love you to death. Anybody else, Cardi B, anybody. Beyonce, J-Lo. Motherfuckers always got something to say about a motherfucker. But you the one that ain't shit. Nigga, you ain't shit. All right? Now sit on that, my nigga. No, I, hey, I was going to give a homeless guy some money one night, and he smacks my hand. <laughs> and he says, if he can say, do you have any spare change, he can say, welcome to McDonald's. Can I help you, please? <laughs> you <know? laughs> So as you can see, they don't care nothing about us, aka the fans. All they do is want your bread. They just, they don't care. they don't want you to say nothing. They just want you to go, go be at the concerts and break your pockets, buy their CDs, listen to their crap, feed into them, give them all your attention, all that. They want all everything from you, but they don't give you nothing in return. And um, at the very most. Your quote unquote fan definitely has their opinion on you, your art and what you bring to them. They can definitely judge you because you're being put out in the public eye to do all these things. So your your actions are to be judged. Anybody who presents anything to the world, anytime you step out the house, anytime you make any movements in the world, you're getting judged. That's famous or non-famous. So miss us with that bullshit and stop disrespecting your quote unquote fans with all this shit. Now, I don't know how y'all don't understand, man. I don't know why y'all don't understand that these artists are just here to distract, mislead, and play with your mind. But, hey, go buy your CD. Oh, ain't no more CDs no more. Go uh, digital download their new album because it's about to drop. Y'all better wake up and smell the coffee, man. This shit is not for what you think it is. It's for them to generate money and generate opinion and uh, dominate on your ass and disrespect you at the same time. But, hey, I don't think y'all even care. You probably got the new J's on your feet right now. It's your big homie, Big Betty, man. It's the Real Talk, Real Shit Podcast. Stop supporting these jokers.